Hello, good afternoon, beautiful Virgos all over the world. Welcome back on my YouTube channel, Ivana Tero. This is bonus weekly love tarot prediction and I think a general reading. We will see what we will get. Make yourself comfortable, my beautiful Virgos, and see what will happen. Don't forget, like this video and subscribe on my channel, Ivana Tero. Alrighty, Virgos, this is your first message. Friendship, friendship. You and your friends, you and your tribe, you and your gang, you and, you know, people that you really need in your life. It's so beautiful. <clears throat> it's so beautiful. It's so nice to have friends, right? Friendship means a lot to you. Maybe there's a specific, you know, person who now is just a friend to you, but maybe, maybe, maybe later you can expect maybe to deepen this relationship. We will see what will happen. We will see. Beauty. Mm. You are very beautiful, by the way. Taking real good care of your body. Your friends do admire to you, saying probably, oh, you are so beautiful. You have a beautiful skin. You have a beautiful glowing skin, you have a beautiful hair, your face is glowing, you know, something. So you have a beautiful friends, you're healthy, you're beautiful, your friends do love you, and life is beautiful, Virgos, life is beautiful. I think also when it comes to love and the opposite sex, the opposite gender, it looks like among of your friends, there is a person who do admires to you and your beauty. Generally speaking, Virgo people, usually Virgo people are very beautiful in a very specific, tender, etheric type of a way. Okay, Virgos, I really want to give you as much as possible info about this upcoming week. So now I'm using pinkish magical oracle deck and let's see what will happen. Be bold. This is your first message, your first oracle message. Be bold. Let's say you're very beautiful. Maybe you can become an actress, maybe because of beautiful body or face, you know. Maybe you can achieve, you know, a lot of things. Maybe your friends already told you, be bold. You are so beautiful. You know, you can, you can have a career, right? Because of your physical beauty. And why not? Ooh, Virgos, wait a second. Wait a second. This week is going to be crucial for you in some way. Okay, wait a second. Wait, wait. Okay, let me draw another. Be bold this week. In time, you will understand your body is not your enemy. You will understand your body is your vehicle. Your body is your temple. Something about you <clears throat> and your friends. Your friends are telling you something. Be bold this week. Right, there is opportunity for something special and your friends wants to encourage you but kind of you are weighing alrighty this is very interesting reading very interesting indeed let me see what else will happen let's talk about love you also you know this week you need to be very bold because it's time for something specific. Let's find out together. <gasps> there you go. It's time for unconditional time. Love. It's time for unconditional love. Among your friends, there is a person who will become more bold. 
This week, this person will approach, they will reach out. This person will admit, because it's time, I'm in love with you. There you go. And you know who wants you. You know it's time. No delay whatsoever. And the best thing is, Virgos, you are already a friend with this person. You are already a friend. Oh la la. Alrighty. I didn't expect, but you have unconditional love. Why am I so, you know, amazed and so confused? Every single time when I see two of cups, I want to kiss you. Okay, honey. Virgos, pay attention. This person wants to kiss you. This person wants to make a laugh with you. You will find yourself in a situation undressing yourself. Maybe you have fear because of your body, thinking, I'm not beautiful enough. What if they don't find me attractive enough? So this is your answer. This week, baby, be bold. And your friends are telling you so many times, but you are beautiful. It looks like you still doubt. This person, with their unconditional love, they're coming to love you. They're coming to heal you. Well, this person will open your mind. This person will free you in some very special, bold way. Virgos, it's time. This week, I beg of you, be bold. You will reveal, you will find out something about yourself, about your body, about life about this person so this person will reach out to you saying i like your body so much i want to kiss you instantly so what you will do nine of pentacles being prudent and everybody knows you are modest you are prudent you don't like probably makeup especially if you're a woman, like a female Virgo, right? And still there's a natural, natural beauty, like a natural woman, but very, 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 very beautiful. Uh, nine of Pentacles is excellent for feeling, you know, good in your skin, with or without makeup. You are proud of yourself, your life, your achievements. You are very proud of yourself. Another Capricorn Virgo Taurus, Person successful, person sexy, person who is ready for you. The biggest question is, are you ready? Because this person is bold, this person is not shy, saying, I want to kiss you. What you will do? Will you allow this person to kiss you or what? If you are attached, of course, you will pay attention uh, on nurturing yourself. I think you do pay attention, you know, your body, your skin, your hair, your nails, your mouth, your teeth, you know, like you are taking a real good care of yourself. Seven of Swords. Uh-huh. Okay, so the main question is, who is saying, I want to kiss you? Because, you know, Seven of Swords, is not a respectful card. If you feel this person wants you just because of your beauty, just because of your body, well, you will say, no, walk away or whatever, right? Seven of Swords is disbelief. Seven of Swords is nasty, nasty card, which talks about lies. You are freaking out. When you feel someone is lying to you, this makes you feeling dizzy. Run away if you're dealing with the people who want to use you because of your beauty. Run away. 
okay? Don't allow any stress in your life. And this is something new. You can rise above every single problem. You can rise above bad people saying a lot of, I don't know, nasty things to you, playing with you, cheating on you or whatever. It looks like you will preserve, you know, your beauty for only one special person. This very special person is already described in Major Arcana the Star. Major Arcana the Star is such a beautiful card which talks about feeling good. It's a tarot card of serenity. Honey, you radiant. People love you. You will become public figure. Something about you is purifying. Almost like this is the end of pilgrimage of some kind. Miracle will happen to you. This could be a beauty pageant. Something right, you know, like, like a beauty pageant or something. You will get an insight. This new love partner is going to be so good. So nice. Capricorn Virgo Taurus. Could be Cancer, could be Leo, also could be Libra. Judgment. This is the wake up call. So honey, what you've been waiting, waiting, waiting for your whole life, you want something special. In this week, something special will happen to you and I hope you will be bold this week because it's time. It's time for the biggest success of your life. A lot of things will be revealed to you. No more being a doormate you know, to a people who are, well, not good. Open your eyes, open your heart. Guys, major kind of the judgment is the biggest test in your life. It's also a confession. Something inevitable will happen and I think you need to stop resisting. Miracle is entering your world. You are starting, you are opening a new chapter. What is waiting on you? Down the road, unconditional love. Make it count. Comment, like, share, subscribe. God bless.